Okay. Because I'm going to be on. I know where that's at. <laughs> I just see a long stretch with trees on. Okay. All sides. Okay. Okay. You're going down the long stretch right now, right? Yep. Okay. When you get to the end of that, there'll be a Y. You're going to head to the right of the Y. Switch is already set. Then you're okay. going to come in and you're going to hang it. You're going to go left you're on the track. Hit another Y. So hang on. You're, you are going to hit another Y. You're going to go left on that one. Once you get kind of to that to the left hand turn, slow down a little bit because I'll be uh, I'm on that track. All right. All right. I'll leave. I'll, I'll turn my light on. You can see me. Or something. Here. Do you hear the whistle yet? No. Well, then you're not that close. Fine. <laughs> oh, speaking of whistle, you can see the uh, rope on the whistle for you. Actually moves. Oh yeah. Does the bell move too? Uh-huh. Yeah. Anyway, I've I've grabbed Sarge's engine. And uh, I'm going to back it up to some cars here. And then I'll have you pull in and then back up eventually to some more cars. And then we'll head up the hill. Sounds like fun, right? Oh, you're going to get the, the full set? Mm-hmm. There's the full sun sign. Aaron Rodgers is... Oh, wow, Sean. Yeah, see, see, storms. That's when you know when the full send it. What is the? I don't know what track those cars are on, so I'm just gonna back past all these and go figure it out. Uh, I don't know that we need left, these two. To the left of those cool cars that you're just going past now on the stream. It's fine. I'll back up and evaluate life. What is the point of this game? Run some steam engines around a map. First, you have to build all the track, and then, yeah. Oh. Around the curve. oh no, Chuck. That's not good. I don't know why a torn Achilles is a irrational fear of mine. I'm gonna be honest. I've seen videos where like you can hear it pop, you know? Uh. Ugh. Gives me the heebie jeebies just thinking about it, you know. Just saying. Alright, I wanna pull through on the Okay. I wasting time here, but that's fine. Well, at least the way that Storms will be coming in, he'll come in on that outside track. I see the brakes still lock up. <laughs> well, don't go 100%. I know, I know. I was testing, okay? Don't worry, I did that too. Alright, Tomcat, thanks for the bits. I f figured that would have been why. That Chinese is hitting hard tonight. <laughs> Dude, Chinese sounds good. Wait, you had Chinese food storms? Yep. Shrimp fried rice. Nice. Aren't right, you lucky? Alright, Mr. Storms. We'll, uh... Let's see, you're pulling through on the far outside track, right? Yeah. Okay, uh, before you hit the switch, uh, at this other end of the train yard where you're at right now, uh, go ahead uh -huh. and stop and we'll ditch your cars there, okay? Alright. Alright. And we'll just leave them. Leave them over there. I'm going to jump over. How many cars is that, actually? Hold on. we got to do some count real quick. So at least, ironically, I put my log cars to the right of the small log cars. Yeah. we got cars everywhere over here. That's all I know. Well, they're organized. Yeah. All right, hold up here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Why do we have two extra cars just sitting around over there? That's weird. Ah, oh, these are both tens apiece, so that's what we're going to run. Oh, I'm on the track with that stupid caboose, aren't I? Oh, dang it, Bobby. Chose the wrong track, yo. Dang it, Johnny. Yeah. It happens. It definitely happens. Alright, so we gotta go on the fourth track. For a second here. If I had the extension, I would know this, but... It's fine. All right, so that one needs to go this way. 
This needs to go this way. All right. And Starms, after I get through here, if you want to pull up, you can. I was um, looking at the new engines in the uh, thing. Oh, that's right. You probably haven't seen half of them, have you? Nope. <laughs> I have a whistle. Not afraid to use it. Actually, I kind of am. Sorry, Chad. It's really loud, I know. Kind of jarring. Oh, rats. I'm clear of you. Whenever you're ready. I feel like with all these uh, R's, we almost just need an area where we can just, like, it's just long enough for maybe 12 cars. We only run 10. Long enough for 12, and we can just, like, back in a bunch of cars. So you don't have this where I'm like, oh, God, what track is that again? I got to go all the way to the other end, you know? Like, I like this kind of stuff for whole trains, like trains with an engine. I mean, we could just shorten up, like, that whole yard. No, I'm just, I like this for all the different engines that we have, but I'm saying, like, have just a, a back-end yard only. Well, well, that's what I was saying, like, mod use that concept to modify that yard so it's yeah long enough for the, the big engines to have 10 or 12 cars. Yeah. We could. All right, Starz, no I'm taking. No what engine you have, you have room. You want, I don't know if something's going on with the game, or if these cars are all rolling, and I just hit a bunch of car. Oh, yep. okay, that one just disappeared. Yep. DC. Um, <laughs> did you put a okay. brake on your cars before you let go of them? Oh yeah. I did. Okay, and you're fine. Just keep going. It's just yeah. all the other cars. It's just all G-Sync for you. Later. Uh, Castle Grumpy, gotcha. There is a we. On our No Man's Land map that we're playing, there is a uh, rock, a big dump truck, like a quarry style dump truck. Big dump truck. And that thing's horn is so loud, it peaks no. my audio. No. In my OBS. Yeah, Starbs, if you go to the number one track, I'm, I'm taking the number two track cars. They are, it okay. is. Loud. I'm guessing that'd be the inside track. The farthest inside one, yeah. We'll call that okay. number one, I guess. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. One, yeah. one go going, and then out. And then I'll check your last car for a break if you check mine when you get hooked up. Because I don't know if what has brakes on or not. You know what I'm saying? So we don't both have to run. Yep. Yeah. And then shackle. Take the brake off. Nothing there. All right, back it up. But it's so loud. It's way louder than this. Oh, those cars are rolling now? I know I took the brake off, but like, come on now. I thought this train yard was flat. What happened to that? That part must be going downhill, and then that little hill there. I, yeah, I'm gonna have to stop. I need, I need brakes. I need brakes. I need brakes. Working on it. I'm good. <laughs> okay. Okay, my train is hooked up. Brakes are off on that car. Usually, we only set one on the ends, so hopefully, we're good. Um, that's another thing. We need to make an area flat for cars. Are actually slope. Uh, these cars are rolling towards you, Storms, just for the record. Hopefully you're ready for them. One's on the other line are ro rolling backwards for me, too. What's rolling backwards? Oh, nope. They just... Yep, desync. <laughs> Don't mind me. You want these cars to roll or, or no? It's fine. About to hit them right now. Well then, if nothing else, you've got no brakes on back here, and uh, you're good to go as far as I'm concerned. That's crazy, crazy there, uh, casually grumpy. It's like when you're watching a YouTube video and they cut to like a, say a farming YouTube video, okay, and they cut to like a montage like of drone footage, 
and I swear they looks like they'll have music, whoever. And this I've seen this numerous times, right? And uh, they'll cut to like a music montage, right? And then the music is just so loud you can't hear yourself think, you know. And it's like, do y'all not listen to this when you edit? Like, how's this? How's this work? You know, crazy. Did you check my last car storms? Yeah. Was the Pretty break sure. off? Pretty sure. Okay. Now you got me questioning it. I just feel like it's really heavy, but these cars are heavy, and I'm not used to Sarge's engine either, so. As long as the last one's off, we should be. Yeah, it says zero. Okay, we'll need it later, but for now it needs to stay off. Unbalanced audio, yeah, exactly. All right, so Sarge, we'll go meet up on the other side of the world, okay? <laughs> okay. Uh, hopefully you have an open track in front of you. You should, right? All right, Trent, he should, right? He should. Yeah. I mean, he'll just be going through the one deep. track that, or the sighting that I had come out of. Okay, that's fine. As long as it should be clear. thought for a second I was about to smoke that caboose, and I was like, um, I don't want to do that. I love playing with the uh, regulator going up this hill. Right. Oh yeah, Starbs, we don't have your, uh, this, you know, new map. But we don't have your uh, ridge riding away all the way to the cold line. <laughs> we have a river run uh, instead. And you get to play around with the regulator, on, at least with these big engines. The question is, do we let Starbs go first or do I go first? <laughs> Which way should we do it, chat? Trent's already, like, gone. I'm not sure where Trent's at, but he's gone. I'm already on the, the stone curve. Oh, okay. Wow. Alright, so chat. Starms has never been on this run before. Do we let him go first, or do we go first? To guide the way. Um, that is the real question of the day. I ain't scared. He ain't scared. Okay. All right, Trent. So everything from the thing you do for to the okay, that should all be set then, right? Yep. Oh, this one's not going to be set back here though. Hang on, let me jump to this office. Change this one, otherwise we're going to have to go to the roundabout, and we don't want to do that. All right. Now, I will tell you, Starbs, there's a downhill on this that you need to be going slow at the top of the hill because you will be going really fast at the bottom of the hill. All right. It's a little aggressive. And when I mean a little, a, um, a little? I mean a lot. But I'll let you know when it's coming up, okay? All right. I'm going through the, the V right now. Through the V? You know how, like, the track goes in between the mountain? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Hey, you're almost up there, then. And I'm the like best part... almost, like, 10... Well... best part is, well, you, you can kind of unload, I guess, while you're up there. Yeah. Before we get there. Full send. No, you see, if you have full send, then you go too fast. Yeah, I'm close to Jacob where I'm at. You don't yeah. go full send. So floor it. No, no floor it. <laughs> but your full throttle can barely go. Well, I mean, these trains are made for climbing mountains. They weren't made for, you know, flat out, like, high speed bullet trains, you know? Watson boy just resubscribed for 50 months. Watson, welcome back for 50 months. Do appreciate the resub. Do appreciate it. I, I did find out because I had to go turn on the light for my dog that you can go from a complete stop uh -huh. going again with this engine. Oh, going up the hill? Uh-huh. Nice. 
So I'm going past, or I'm going through the uh, hairpin turn. Okay. Well, that's not a good place to stop. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not stopping. Oh, okay. I got gotcha. you. I stopped like further down the line. I got gotcha. you. All right, so storms, you should see a little bridge. Yep. And then an engine shed on the right. Uh, where we never actually put an engine. Uh, but yep. you know where the where the where the world kind of falls off up here in a minute. And before yeah, we had like so. a track that looped out to the left, you know. Uh, there's a track that basically goes straight now. Uh, we're gonna go. It's it's to the left on a Y. But it's kind of straight, and it goes across the big bridge. Uh, oh, that that one you're gonna have to turn the left if you're going down to the smelter. No, we're not going to the smelter. We're going to the coal mine. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. you're good. Yeah. Use the diesel electric locomotive. Nice fire. Uh, but yeah, so the 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 track kind of takes the nosedive here in a second storm. So uh, be ready for that. Yep. <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> The idea of this engine shed that we just passed was helper engines, uh, but I've not had enough money to buy them yet, so we just haven't done it and haven't actually needed them, so we've been okay. And really, this is, uh, it's not terrible, terrible here, but it's really bad if you're loaded. Obviously, it's really bad if you're loaded. And this is how we get down to the smelter, too, so we will take stuff down there. All right, so to the right is the, uh, well, there's actually a, a dead track here. Again, park a helper engine on if we needed. That right there goes to the iron mine. And then the track above our head storms actually goes from the, the smelter to the iron mine. Which huh. is kind of cool, yeah. And then there, there will be a Y coming up in front of you. It should be set to go straight. But that goes down to the iron, or to the smelter too. Which is kind of cool. So if you're coming from or need to take like, you know, something up this way, you can uh, from the thing. The only thing that sucks is if we're going from the smelter to the coal mine, we actually have to go up the hill to the basically the sawmill and turn around there. And then we come across this track. And then I don't know if you notice that loop track underneath us. Yeah. That goes, so you drive it on one side of the refinery and then leave, or on the smelter, and then leave on the other side. So it's like, it's a loop track. No more having to unhook and just turn engines around and stuff. Actually, we have loop tracks pretty much everywhere. Trent, why? Somebody's character is standing there. That's creepy. What about now? Yeah, it's still there. That's uh, pride and storms. You fall out of your engine, Storms? <laughs> Not that I know of. <laughs> That's creepy. And yeah, this is a pretty good uphill here, too. Uh, so once you get, like, up by the river, um, there will be some gradual kind of ups and downs, but for the most part, you'd probably be able to set your regulator kind of low and just let it roll. So it's a pretty good run. Pretty... <laughs> It's up, Cat, pretty much. John, what's going on, man? How you doing? Oh, gosh. All right. Because most of the hill climb on this run is on the other end. So we go across the river for like the 84th time. So that's about how much you go across the river. Oh, there's a river, and there's a river. Trent, did you put signs up along here? Uh, there's only one. <laughs> I was more focused on maintaining the speed. I gotcha. But I think you'll laugh at the one sign I did put down. It is nice to know our speed. Like, that's actually really nice. It's gonna help us, like, not derail, you know? Lurking and doing classwork. Awesome, John. Gotcha. Gotcha. But that is a new light over here, chat. They put a speed. 
We can actually see how fast we're going. That's going to help when we come down the hill to kind of maintain a, a healthy speed. Yeah, I finally figured out a good regulator speed. For where? The un for unloading with this engine. Oh, yeah? Like 14%. Are you able to unload everything? Uh, not quite. Okay. So you have time if you want to move Black Cat's engine around to load it. One out of 30 and I got more cars. Okay. Or is it full of coal? It might be full of coal. It's basically full. Okay. We're coming to grab like 200. So. so we'll be there in a few minutes. So I'm just how fast are you going for reference? 15. 15, okay. So that's a good speed. I think that's what I was going around. I just didn't want to go faster because it's I can't see your I can see the back of your your lanterns on the back of your engine. I can see that, but that's it. Now we need cabooses. Oh, me. I need to turn my generator on. We need cabooses for running at night. What are you talking about? I have one. Well, you're the only oh. one. I don't I don't think I yeah, I have one on this engine. Yeah, you do. Or at least the B set of cars. Almost see better without the headlight on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, but uh, then you can't hear the turbo. I, yeah, I do like hearing that uh, generator. It sounds like a good old turbo. And a couple weeks ago, Dad and I were over at that truck stop eating lunch, as we do a lot. Don't worry about it. It's a thing. And uh, there was this, like, Ford F... 350 maybe 450 out it was a you know truck right pickup truck and but it was diesel and i don't know what buddy had going on with that truck but it had the loudest turbo i've ever heard yeah like semi trucks are quiet compared to that thing it was crazy that's what i like about my current diesel rather than my uncle's is you can actually hear the turbo it was insane i was like holy cow bud and when he like took off uh, out on the road it was kind of an uphill oh man he Found that bad boy up. Crazy. Alright, I know he's up here somewhere, chat. We're gonna go find him. Yeah, this run doesn't require, uh, it's not as white knuckle as the, uh, the mountain run that we had before starts. Yeah, well, where's the fun in there? Hey, the mountain run. The mountain run was fun, all right? It was. It was a good time. Yeah, he might I don't know what he did to it, if he changed the intake or not. I have no idea. I just know that it was crazy, crazy loud. His turbo. It could also be the exhaust. True. If you take out the mufflers and whatnot. True. Yeah, you're going to get a lot more. Yeah. You do have to remember that turbo, you know, uses the exhaust to spin, so. It could have been. I don't know. I don't. I didn't talk to the guy or anything, but it was crazy loud. Kind of like this. All right, I see his stars up there. Assuming you can hear my whistle, right? No. No, I can hear yours. I'm like right behind you. Kind of. Oh uh, yeah, I see your guy <laughs> levitating above the tracks. <laughs> but that's it. I don't see the train, car, nothing. That's funny. He's a wizard, Harry. I have the switches, everything set for you. I will be right back. All right. Your Nissan, gotcha. When am I playing pool cleaning sim? Is that a thing? I don't know. I'm surprised I haven't gotten a phone call to clean a pool next door to us the first time with being that, you know, with who's in town. I'm surprised I haven't uh, 
received a phone call yet. To be honest, like IRL pool cleaning. I didn't know you're a pool boy, John. I, you know, I have been known to take care of a pool for a little while there, Storm Jim. It's been, it's been a long time since I've, I've messed with it, but yeah, I have. Not quite like that kind of what you're thinking, but you know, yeah. Uh, yeah, no, my buddy, uh, his parents are in town and his pool is basically a slop and I'm sure his father's happy about it. <laughs> Pools are oddly satisfying to clean. I used to like vacuuming the pool. I used to go over there and just volunteer to, va to vacuum the pool. Like more than I probably should have. Yeah. Are they watching me? Well, this is actually a thing. I'm going to run over Starm's looking at this first time. Pool cleaning sims. It's basically power wash sim. Oh. Are they watching me? They know I stream. Yeah, my buddy Casey knows I stream. He's not here. He knows I stream. He's at work right now, actually. He works uh, second. Second shift. Best arms. Oh, hi. You know I'm here yet? <laughs> Still can't see you. Saw a gator in the drain pipe. Wow. All right. So I think this is the last. Yep. Last time we crossed the river from here out, it's uphill storms. Like uh, 50%, I think, the whole way, maybe four. Something like that. But it's it's a constant. Should be a pretty well constant hill climb. So. So just pin it to win it? Uh, no, because there's some really tight curves up here eventually, okay? So. 95%. Got it. Nope. <laughs> More than I am right now, though. Play that much. Probably don't want to go over, like, the 15 mark, as you like, here in a, in a, in a minute. 15 speed, not right. probably 15 is way too much, but well, whatever. 15 is the top speed I can get without oh. going downhill. So. Is it? Yep. Well, that's right. That engine is slow. That's right. I like that engine though because of the flags. So I'll, I'll be honest. Still in all presidential. Yeah. You betcha. I mean, I could push you up the hill, but like that won't end well at all. We'll just not do that. So maybe like 10 would be a good speed up the hill, maybe. Just because of the hairpin turns. Do you mine your own coal? So, uh, kind of. So when you buy an engine, all your tenders come full. And, um,. I say it sounds like it's raining outside it is okay um all of your engines come full or, or your tenders so so far we haven't had to haul coal there's like a coal tower that we can put the coal in and then it becomes coal that we can use in our engines uh so we're actually going to the coal mine to grab coal to take to the refinery I'm back uh, down to like 11 12 now that's fine you know? yeah you're gonna get into a, some real tight curves here in a second uh, where you're at, so. Mr. Plugger, good evening. How's it going? Hey, Plugger. So, yeah, it's going to start getting real hairy for you there, Storm. So, your engine's going to start rocking real good, so. Yeah. Just watch your speed. But if we have to pick up cars, it's fine. Not a big deal, you know? Uh, so we have had to build all of the rail. We are currently not building any rail, although I wouldn't mind doing something over at our uh, at our rail yard. Because we have a bunch of, like, cars, and it's just kind of disorganized. And I feel like we can organize it better than we have it now, basically, is what I'm getting at, so...
Bam. Yeah, here's the first, like, tight corner that I don't like, but whatever. I'm going 12 miles. Speed 12, whatever that unit of measurement is. And then I think you're at, like, a real tight one, aren't you? Yeah, it's pretty tight here. Yeah. Yeah. But we followed the, you know, we followed. I couldn't quite, yeah, get it exactly like I wanted, but it's close enough. And then I don't know how Trent has switches set, but, uh, you know, you're, uh, you're still, I guess, a couple curves away from me. Yeah. So just don't, you know, you're fine. Run him over. I don't care. Oh, God. That's I, I don't care either. I'll just ult that four and go to bed. <laughs> uh, fully nine o'clock. What are you talking about? Man? The last couple days, I have just been dog tired. Oh, yeah? I don't know why. Just... All right. Too much, too much excitement on Saturday running uh, the, the mine and stuff. Uh, maybe. <laughs> or it's my back hurting and nah. all the weather and blah, blah, blah. I got you. Nine. Yeah, it's, we're in the United States, so it's 8, 11 for me. Storms is East Coast time, so it's 9, 11 for him. 9, 11 on 9, 11. There you go, yeah. All right, and then this curve, I don't like any of these curves. I, I put this track down about 84 times here, right. but whatever. They're at the top, finally. Nice. Very nice. Oh, this is a loop back too, so we don't have to unhook anything here either. We have loop backs everywhere, I think. Yeah, we don't have to unhook uh, or turn trains anywhere, which is super nice. makes life a lot faster all right last curve and then there's going to be stop trains in front of me i believe so gotta be careful here although we're shedding speed you want me to stop here to load or yeah that's fine go around no 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 you're good go ahead and load up i'll run up and help you load Cause I'll be basically on the flat land too, most of my train anyway, so we'll uh we'll be good. Uh oh. <laughs> Wait, did you are you past it? Yeah, I'm a couple past. Okay, I'll back up. You have a veteran cold train, I gotcha. I got you, Spur. I got you, man. That's cool. And actually, there's a second inbound track over here, too. I don't know that we've ever used it, but, you know, if we came up here with a bunch of cars, it'd be cool to be cool to use it. No, I, I get you. Yeah, the bot thinks you uh, tried to put a link in because you didn't put the space, but it's all good, man. It's all good. All right, a little bit farther back storms. Hopefully we can get this other train out of here one of these days. <laughs> All right, that's good. That'll work. We get the bounce going here. Fun. I guess not. Not cooperating. Come on. So what you're saying is you're sleep driving a train storm. Is that what you're getting at? Yep. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm in danger. You're behind me. You're all right. All right. Come on. You're not wrong, Jeff. You're not wrong. Starting to pull up one car. Wait, do we do we want to put markers in here? Oh, wrong way. 
Up to you. Plug her a nuclear reactor. <laughs> Great, Scott. All right. laughing at plugger i mean plugger there are people that mod um mod the map they move the industries around um so they're not in the same places so it's like instead of hauling oil like a short run like we were doing earlier you could haul like across the map i'm back welcome back we we're gonna help you load one three cheered dex 100 that's roscoe p collie train to you Bear, thanks for the uh, for the bits. Welcome in. How are you? Yeah, Trent, come here and run the other shoot if you don't mind. We'll uh, the, get this done. Head up. Yeah. That's over there playing with the train whistle chat. Bear, how's it going, man? Welcome Did you in. Hear the other one? Yes, I heard it. Don't worry. <laughs> Definitely heard it. All right, Storm, so you're good for a car. No, get on the ladder. That's like I can't climb on the train. Well, on those box cars, I could at least that climb could. up the ladder. A little more. We got both shoots now. We can run. All right. Yeah, the box cars have the nice ladder, which is really cool. Get this train full in no time now. Or something like that. I couldn't get it to work earlier. I was trying. Alright. Alright, Storms. That's great with two two people to load. Uh how do you have switches set over there, Trent? Is he good to drive around when he gets full or no? Uh-huh. Right, park on the third track. I did that before I had a Go restock the right. fridge. Uh, a little more, probably, Storms. Mind. Get to restock, what, like the beverage fridge? My uh, garage fridge. Oh, the beverage fridge, huh? Uh huh. <laughs> you know, we've never had a fridge in our garage. We used to, well, we do. We have a fridge in our basement, though. But we also so used here to. At the farm, we've always had a. A fridge with the freezer attached to it. Yeah. Yeah. And now we've added a uh, deep freeze. All right, Storms. We've always had, yeah, we always did. We used to have a chest, like a big chest freezer out here in the garage. Basically what we got. Yeah. Except for we never, like, used anything in it. It was bad. I say nowadays the garage fridge is right. just beverages. See, we used to go to like, oh, well, we still do, but like, we used to go to Sam's Club and we'd buy like 15 dozen eggs. Because, you know, big family. Because there's lot, lots of eggs, you know. Or like multiple gallons of milk, and then it would just go down to the fridge um, in the basement. Uh, no, no, there you go. Yep. All right. Uh, uh, we need a hand, no, like, I had to go hand whistle. I said I'd grab me a pet. Um, Alright. Arms. Ah! ah! The shoot! That hurt! <laughs> oh, it hit me right in the face, Bobby! Dang old man, I'll tell you what. That is very true, Bear. The thing you need is always at the bottom. All right, Storms. Are you taking my spot, Trent? Okay. Let's see how it is, bro. Polar bear. That's why, like, in the uh, chest freezer, we kind of keep it maybe half full. Yeah. All right, Storms. Polar bear, what's going on, man? How you doing today? Hope all is well. I didn't fall off the car. Wasn't me, chat. Nope. Nope. <laughs> All right, you good? Oh yeah, Sean, I saw that hurricane was going that way. 
I saw that. I think it might. I don't know. I haven't looked at the forecast lately, but. I saw it up there. All right. Whoa, whoa. Sorry. You mean go backwards? Uh, no, we're actually. Are we filling two cars right now, Trent? Are we filling a car and then an in between? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Yep, yours is drive. You're driving. <laughs> Coal blocks on the ground. Trant, it's going on the ground stuff. Trant! What? We're yours is going on the ground. Production. No, it's going on the ground. You're wasting it. Unlimited. <laughs> no, it's not. Uh, we that... just have to bring products up. Oh, we can't have anything nice. All right, sir. So you don't need to go very far, like half a car at most. <laughs> I thought we figured out a life hack here to fill two cars, but like, no, we're just dumping on the ground. All right. I guess dump on the ground too. Oh. You're kind of in the car. Can't tell if it is or not. I don't think. Be it is. there. Oh, three one three. Oh, one hundred. Coal on the ground. Coal on the ground. Looking like a fool with your coal on the ground. Hat turned sideways. Something, something. Looking like a fool with your coal on the ground. Yeah, I got you. I got you, Bear. Bear, thanks for the bits. Very good. Looking like a fool with your pants on the ground. God, who remembers that chat? Welcome mm -hmm. to Boomer Talk. <laughs> Hashtag boomer talk. Holy cow, man. Ooh, uh, a little more storms. Yeah, we definitely need... You know what? Here's what we'll do. Perfect, 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 perfect. This is all we need to do. A little more storms. Once you get set here, we'll just run along and I'll put markers all along your train. Then it's done. That's good. That'll work. That's not Boomer Talk. It's Gen X Talk. Okay. Fair play. Back in my day. Hey, I still remember the first season of Survivor. Oof. That's like 20 years ago. Oof. I know. <laughs> we had a party that night. The The night of the finale, we went, uh, we went to the local grocery store. And for some reason, we thought it was funny to buy like gummy worms because we're like, ah, they've been eating gum, they've been eating worms. And we went and bought gummy worms and we ate those while we watched the final episode where uh, Richard Hatch won the first season of Survivor. Why do I remember that? I don't know, but I sure do. Grant, that's facing the wrong way. You know that, right? If you're looking from the other way from driving the engine. <laughs> Wait, wait, whoa, 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 where are you putting them? What's the marker? Each car. You, you got to put it at like the corner of the car. It'd be easier to see, wouldn't it? You're just putting it like right in the middle of the car. I mean, we can put it at the middle of the car. That's Who, fine. As long as we all know what's going on here. Who gave Trent the signs in the first place? I was just thinking the little white marker is all we need. No? Yeah. I mean... What cleaner what's that, look to? What's that even under the... It's the first one. Oh, that's the flange. Just when you go in there, it's literally just the... Oh, it's just rail. Just, it's literally just a piece of rail. I'd put it right on the right on the front corner of, of each car. That's Be all there, I would do. 0313 Chaird X100. Yeah. Trent. By the way, Bear, did you notice they added, like, signs and stuff in this game? Bear, they to the bits. All right, Starms, once, uh, once this is done, wait, okay, once this is done, um, go ahead and pull your train up, uh, switches should be set for you, and I'll bring my train in, you guys load me up, and pull. let's see, we need to empty Trend's train, right? Uh, the last four, I think. Okay. Uh, Bear, they added all kinds of signage. They added, um, 
They've added like all kinds of set pieces, so like houses and barns and banks and. All right, I think you're good. Yeah. So we can actually put signs up now to like you know tell you when to stop at a. Do you want me to back in when storms gets out of the way? Cause I got room now. You mean back in? Oh, like let storms. Uh, yeah, I'll back. Or yeah, we can use this other track here if you want. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> right, right, Bear, they were watching us and they're like, signs. Oh my God. <laughs> Great idea. Yo, Dan, welcome in. What's going on? <laughs> yeah, Trent, we, okay, here's, here's what we're going to do. Starms pulls in, Trent, you back up, get on this other line next to me. And then that way I can go and then get out of your way, okay? How about that? We can pull black hats ahead and then back in as well. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully we can get black hats engine empty tonight. Hopefully. Exactly. Uh, I would have settled for like some paint on the rail or something, you know, just some kind of marker. But this this will be nice as well. So figuring out position of the markers is what we're at first. I was going for like the front of the engine, but, um, I think the car makes more sense, but it is also is kind of hard to tell, but that way, depending on if we have different engines, uh, the front corner of the car is going to make sense. So, yeah. I think that'll, I think that'll work out, you know? All right. Like the, uh, like the loop back here, Storms? Yeah, not too shabby. Works. The one at the iron mine is kind of sketchy, though, I won't lie. Because that's, it's a really tight curve. There's two really tight curves on that loop back, but it's fine, it works. Yeah, exactly, Bear. I know. That's the problem. Yeah, same cars, different engines, yeah. It'd be nice if it was, like, the front of the engine, but you just can't do that. Realistically, so it's fine. We have some we have to move because we did set some for my engine, but it's all good. And, you know, like I said earlier, too, it's like if you just get close, it's gonna be good enough you know uh Trent you need me to throw the switch in front of me here if you're able to yeah okay second here I did my Ron Pratt retoots uh going in reverse oh I heard you don't worry I definitely heard it. All right, that switch is flipped for you, Trent. All right, you I'm currently cards. refueling myself. All right. All right. Apparently that's cold and not going in the firebox. <laughs> I still don't think we're going to be empty, able to empty black cats. There's so much there still. This means we need to haul more was it, coal. Was it 10 per? 10 per, yes sir. All right, next one. Yep. Fell Zero Me Farm 81 just resubscribed for 40 months. Hey yo John, what's going on bud? Wow, 40 months at this awesome community. Glad to be a part of it. Hope all is well. Lonely, welcome back for 40 months to appreciate the resub. All is... All is well. I can't hear Dude. myself think sometimes, you know? Uh, I do appreciate the reset, man. How's it going? Welcome back. So really, okay, so here's the other thing we were talking about, right? I can just tell roughly with this engine, if I just put that marker on the front bumper of this engine, we should be good, too. I don't even have to. Yeah. So we should be good. Next one. 
Wait, you got that full already? Yep. Really? How the heck do you get yeah. that full wall that fast? I'm good with the mouse. You Were you don't, like, put it up as far as we Are you filling as I was moving? Is that what it is? No. No. Alright. 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 I'm mad skills. I am skills, dog. Alright. Is that good there? Yep. Oh. Armor. Armor. What what armor? Alright, so Trent, you're gonna back down and then stop. You gonna pull up behind me then? Yep. Oh. Go ahead. I cannot believe you're okay. You're doing the you're getting it to work. I couldn't get it yep. to work earlier. All right. Are you still clear of the uh, switch? In the front? Yep. Yeah. I had a couple cars to go. Before I'm there. You bringing Black Ass Trainer in? Yep. All right. That's Is that all right, Storms? Yep. All right. Yeah. So if I go about the front wheel or so, we're, we're chilling. We are chilling, y'all. Going a lot, mighty eleven miles, whatever that is. All right. It is a strange way. We'll say we'll say um, miles per hour. Go ahead. Can't even built my firebox. Guys got me working overtime, chat. <laughs> oh, man. It's all right, though. I just can't see my engine. Ah, uh, you're nowhere near it. Is that good enough? Yeah. yeah. I'm crouched. Hello? All right, so when I get full, then I'll pull over on the track that Trent just came out of and get out of the way over there. I'm moving. X. Yep, yep, yep. Um, actually, I don't know if you're going to be able to back in all the way, Trent, or you'll have to move your train back farther first. Not sure. You might have to use, move your engine. Why is the front of a train a different color? Uh, I don't know, Sean. Go back to the 1800s and as, I don't know. I'm assuming maybe that's not part of the boiler, like the black parts of the boiler. I don't know, because that's where the... I don't know. All right, it looks like you have a couple cars. You're barely going to make this. Okay. Couple car lengths. All about precision, John. What? Blind you. Alright, Trent. You're about no two and a half cars, Trent. <laughs> I got double head ice on this. <laughs> Dude, it's so bright over here right now. <laughs> Yo, it's a lit, bro. It is a lit up in these parts. Thank you for my marker. Is this the last one, or we got one more car? Two more cars. Two, two more. And so your, car, your front car is not even at the front post yet. Well, okay, fair play. I'm not using the car for my marker. I've been using the front of my engine. I'll use the car on the next two, though. Although it's hard to see. Hey, now. Hey, now. Hey, now. Hey, now. Are you done already, Starms? Yep, go ahead. Hey, you're slow. My goodness, this guy. It might even be like a, be able to do a 2%. Yeah, just keep moving, yeah. Almost. That is so hard to see. That good there? Yep. Yeah. 
can't see a thing. How do you turn the back light on this engine, Trent? I don't know. There isn't one. Oh, on, on Black Hat's engine. You just turn the whole generator on. Much better. <laughs> That's weird because the front light was on on that engine. The back light wasn't. I'm, I'm, I can't tell if you're still moving storms or not. Go ahead. All right. Yeah, I can't. I can't tell. So that's when you buy another one of those hill climb engines and you put it facing it's, towards. It's our mobile light tower. Oh man, but it adds an element, right? Adds adds some difficulties here and dark and stuff. All right, I think. Right about, it leaves the edge of the screen. Uh, right there, right? Yep. All right. That'll work. All right, Trent, you back in your engine down the hill yet or no? Uh, not yet. Yeah. So probably want to pull your engine first before Black Hats, right? I would assume. All right. You're full. All right. All right, I'll go get out of the way now. Then we'll play Leapfrog with these other engines and get them as empty as possible. Still don't think we're going to be able to empty Black Cats, but that's okay. It can just live up here forever. That train right has... Right now, but... it only says we need 11 rails. Yeah. So that engine, he literally bought it. We hooked it up to those cars, went and filled it with rail, and it came up here, and that's all it's done since he bought it. <laughs> it's just been sitting here for, like, months at this point. Thanks, Trent. How many channel points do you have now? 132. Wow. Uh, thanks for that follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? I can tell the river's low, by the way. Whenever the river gets a little low, our low water kind of tastes funky. Tastes like, you know, chemicals. And the river's really low here right now. Get you one of those Brita filters. Right. They, they claim it's safe. They just have to add, like, more, you know, to it to clean yeah. it. I just filled up my jug right before stream and you, you, I can taste it. it. Wasn't like this yesterday in our, our house anyway. That's right. All right. So I'm going to park. Park over here in a second. <laughs> well, bear, if we had the extension running, we could, but... You know, it's okay. I don't think we're going to be able to empty it either. No. And at least to me, there's no point in taking it back down the hill till it's empty. So. We're going to empty a trend strain, I'm assuming. Or close to it anyway. But, uh, yeah, there's no point in taking it back down the hill unless it's empty. Oh, you're going to help me in the storms? It will help you. Yeah, I can. Okay, I'll go back then. Yeah, we're here yeah. to help. I'm, we'll start our journey when it's daylight, you know? <laughs> yeah, because I've already set, like, my regulator to unload. Oh, we're not... You know what? There's no point in even messing with Black Hat's engine. Okay. Yeah, we're not even going to touch it, because we, we don't even need a car load, so... Let's just get Trent and get out of here. Fly, Trent. Oh. It's, it's going on. Go faster. Gotta go all the he'll way. Just to, to, he'll just have to slow down. <laughs> I know, but he's got to go all the way to the back of his train here. Why do I have firewood in my hand? How long have I had that in my hand? I've been running a coal train for a while. Yeah, or you know. Is it smelling like coal? Hmm. I could try doing that, I guess. When you get 
bugs in there. Dust. I should probably get one of them, like, Brita things, huh? Or something. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, there's a whole debacle with water in our town, but I'm not going to talk about it on stream, but it's a whole thing. We'll just say that much. All right. You hitting the button, sir? It's okay. Yep. Arms getting that money. Oh, wait. Did you join my company? Yep. Okay. Set up. Ten thousand dollars, y'all. I thought whenever you uh, join, right. it's kind of like automatically yours. I don't think so. Oh, so I, I only have five every time. Yeah. Five eighty-three. Only. All right. You ready to set out then? I reckon. All right, I'm gonna fill my uh, firebox up. And um, hello. Get in the engine, John. Hello. Oh, hello. There we go. All right. We, we did it. Uh, who's leading? Uh, don't matter to me. You can, I guess. All right. Let's go. Trent's like, dang, I want to lead. Didn't matter to me, but I mean, granted, I'm empty. So you'll be slower, right? We have weight pushing us. <laughs> All right, down the hill we go, chat. Uh, I've got 100 coal on board. Arms has 100 coal on board, and Trent is empty. I'm already going faster than that. Yulberry just resubscribed for 16 months. I've already got the storms his last three cars. Yulberry, welcome back. Do appreciate the resub for 16 months. How are you? How's it going? So through these bends, I'm not. I'm gonna try to not go too much more than 15. Okay. Roger. So don't run me over. Okay. Try not to. Once we get down on uh, like to the river, then then we'll open it up and go about 20. Okay. Uh, right, DGM, I'll hello. Try not to run over storms. Welcome in. How are you? Hope all is well. But realistically, I'm going like 10 up here in these these early uh, curves. Okay. 12 right now. 11. So. Not trying to set any land speed records right now. We'll do that later. Before you know that big hill that we went down earlier, storms. Mm -hmm. It'll take everything these engines have to get up that hill. Yoberry, I'm behind storms in. Yoberry, we did find our trains. Uh, turns out I'm an idiot. I loaded an old save, so everything's fine. Everything is fine. This is a different farm. Yeah, this is the uh, train map uh, farm. No, this game looks way better than Farm Simple. Who am I kidding? Yeah, it's called Railroads Online. It's a bit of a different game, but it's a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Storms, I just see you floating. <laughs> oh, I see John's last car. An only last car. Alright. I'm uh, increasing my speed slow a little because this we're past the really bad curves. Well, come on, floating John. Go faster. I am going faster. What map are we playing tomorrow? We are playing um, the the West West by West B West B. Yeah, West B. You got it. West B. Uh, Wisconsin, right? Yep. Yeah, we're playing West B Wisconsin tomorrow. It's already on the server. It's ready to go. Have you figured out where you're gonna settle? No. Train track Gabriel, welcome in. How's it going? Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I think I'm going to start with contracts because I went in there today or went on the save and I hit like refresh contracts with the better contracts mod and like a ton popped up. So I think I'm probably going to start with like harvest contracts tomorrow. Uh, but you might not like those. Why? Because they're 
I think you can get 99% done. Oh, are they broken? I've done a harvest contract on there and it worked out well. Oh. I think it must depend on like what crop. Oh, really? There's issues, huh? Now you tell me. <laughs> Maybe I don't want to play this map. I don't know. Well, the plan is I'm playing it tomorrow. I barely do contracts, so. If I have issues, I have issues. I guess I'll have to take a loan and just buy some land and buy equipment, huh? Because I only have a hundred grand, so I'm going like 18 right now. Well, go faster. No. Still going downhill. Faster. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking it too, Bear. Don't worry. 20's fast enough. That's when we hit brakes. Just saying. All right, I'm approaching the river at the head of the train here. So once I hit river, river, I'll open up the regulator and actually be running. Still running. Okay, so I'm slowly catching up speed with storms is pulled away from me. Yeah. I'll catch up to him. <laughs> Hopefully you can see his last car when you catch up to him too. You don't run him over. I see. I still see him floating, so he's not that far away. All right, I'm across the river and the uh, regulator's on. Probably gonna go for about 20. For the record. I think 40% gives you 20. At 30 yeah. right now, I'm going 20. But this is also flat right here. There are some ups and downs to this track. Oh hey, got back up to you. Oh, hey, how's it going? Did you? I don't see you. Yeah, I just seen your last car. I just oh, you your again. last car. I got you. Thank you, Sean. GG's. You say 40% Trent? 50% right now? Going up a little hill right here. Well, I was coming the opposite way, so. That's true, it's all different, yeah. True, true. All different. But yeah, how's everybody doing on this Monday night shot? Those of you that get here. Hope everybody's having a good one. Looking forward to a new farm sim map tomorrow. It's it's wild, man. The fields are wild on that map. Oh hey, I see uh storms back the train. I Might. tapped out at fifteen mile an hour. Oh, that's right. That train goes slow. I forgot about that. All right, get me a push. Well. Doing some law yet. All right. All right. Getting colder. Only got up to 98. Break out the parka? That's one way to look at it. <laughs> Wow, that's still pretty toasty. And then like so this. Speaking of like temps going down. I know this this week's gonna be nice. Love that, and I saw the first combine going down the road today. Oh yeah. He was yeah. pulling it, uh, or one guy was going down the road, and then he, at least around here, it's a pickup truck and a header cart. It's crazy how like different, you know, because like Carn's harvest is in full swing see full swing now for about a week over here yeah uh, i don't know if this guy was gonna go cut some beans or if he was are you guys doing beans first over there uh, i don't i don't know what he was doing but oh do they typically run beans first over there uh i guess it really depends on when you planted oh i gotcha gotta take a win when you can true true that is very, very true. I forgot this bridge kind of goes downhill going this way. Yeah, it kind of goes up here and it goes down there. And... Yeah, I'm, I am going to have to stop and throw a switch or two, by the way. At least one. For us, Storms. 
Yeah. Well, no, more than one. One for sure, and then I'll probably, what I'll do is I'll just go teleport and go throw the rest of them real quick. Yeah. Hang yeah, Storms, are you going faster than 25? Uh, I was. I just started breaking. I was say, I was able to see your last car, and then you went poof. <laughs> He's got that downhill momentum. Yep. Yep. That's a quick break. 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 <laughs> so you kind of have to drive the train a little bit on this run. Especially when you're loaded. You kind of actually have to hit brakes at times. Oh, and even going uphill. Oh, yeah. No, both ways, yeah. I, I Ideally, I would redo this track and try to flatten it out. Or at least make it not so like noticeable, you know. The ups and downs. An even percent. Try, yeah. Like to all the way going up. Yeah, but that's like a lot of work. So. <laughs> you could and probably so like I kind of just like pinned on to the back here. You could probably straighten this track out a lot too, but I don't mind it. The part I don't like is how it's just all elevated. It should be like down on the ground more. But it there works is out. at times. Yeah. On the other end of the line. But right here, it's pretty close to the other ground. As the ground comes up to it. But that's all right. It's all good. We're just chooching along, y'all. Or something like that. Rats. Oh, where we need to slow down? No. Yeah, this first steel bridge coming down is pretty, uh, not super aggressive, but, you know. Enough where I would like to slow down a little bit. Although, you do need speed by the time you hit to the other end of the, the real bridge, so. I mean, Rise, you really just center that bridge, kind of just seem to full send it. Yep, pretty much. Pretty much full send. Uh, I will, actually. Chat, you guys always talk about full sends. Get ready. Buckle up, y'all. Get the emotes out. Oh, will probably just have to help storms. And... That train will make it. It'll be slow, but that train will make it. I've done it. Done with the hundreds finally, that's good. Alright, Chad, here we go. Full send. Oh my god, I'm going 30, 29 right now. Dude, I'm going way too fast. I don't like this. Going 29. That is not good at uh, talking there, John. You have to full send. <laughs> I am, but I don't like it. Do that. Why am I not losing any speed going up this hill? What? Okay, two miles an hour down. Three, four, five, six. I lost six miles an hour going up that hill. That's it. This engine's got power. I still have all Boy, my cars. Yeah, you have momentum. Yeah, I had a lot of momentum there. Dude, that was crazy. That was kind of crazy. Are you on the steel bridge yet? I uh, just got onto the bridge. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. You have to like ride uh, your brakes and then you I floor hope that's it. Desync. Oh god. What happened? Oh, we rocking, we rocking, we rocking. Something kind of weird about that. Oh, that, that was a little scary there. <laughs> what happened? My internet kind of buffered. Oh. My engine went... Derailed. My engine derailed. Everything derailed except for the ten tender. Oh. I hate when that happens. And I didn't know how close I was to Swarm, so... Gotcha. 
All right. I don't so... know about you, Swords, but I'm going 30. 46. Up the hill. Fully dropping. Uh, no, we're going over the bridge now. Gotcha. Steel trestle bridge. Okay. All right. So. I have to stop over here and throw a switch. I might be able just to do this before you guys get here. Although I was going to teleport over and do the other ones. Uh, when you get up on flatland storms, like the, uh, where that engine sheds at. Uh huh. Go like slow past there. I'm up around the corner, but I'm going to be away from my train for a minute. Throwing switches. All right. All right. So try don't run them over. Okay. I mean, I kind of just gave him a little nice tap to go up the hill. <laughs> Did you really? Oh yeah. I, I went from 26 to six real fast. Even at 90% regulator. I, yeah, that, that, that's a real hill there. It really is. Wait, how, how am I stopped? You stopped? Uh huh. That's a problem. That's an issue. Oh, because, oh, probably because like my whole attraction wheels are centered. They're Rutt locked row. up. Rut row. All right, I'm passing the uh, engine house right now. Yeah. Big news from Monday Night Football. Somebody got hurt, right? Right? Isn't that what it is, Bear? What What's going on, Wait. man? Oh, I forgot. There was football tonight. Yeah. It's funny, we're all about Thursday Night Football, and then I don't watch any of the rest of it. Yeah, I... I think it's a, it's more of a social thing for me, you know? Yep, pretty much. It's like, yay, sports ball. I think it's fun to watch as a group, and what I really find entertaining is how we all, like, get passionate about it for no reason. And then, like... that we don't even care about? Yeah. 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 All right, I am. Uh, yeah, we'll watch that football game. I am back in my engine and I am moving. Slowly, but I'm moving. Go ahead, Starms. I don't know where you're at, but. Just came through that bridge past the uh, train house. Okay, you're good to roll. Got hurt on the fort. Wow. Yeah, they were saying possible Achilles or something, Bear. Sun blew out his ankle or something. I don't know. Pretty bad. Guys, this should have retired last year, you know? This is fourth or fifth time coming out of retirement. Right. It didn't the Lions put him away last year? I don't even know. Crystal elimination this Saturday. Oh, well. All right. Not good. No official report. Gotcha. Okay. That's Brady. Oh, man. Brady did retire like four times. They had him at the game yesterday. I saw a clip of that. Probably sitting there like, I got my gear in my car. No, they were doing like a, a Tom Brady appreciation day or something. Something like that. I don't know. I think it was like a, his uh, retirement for his number 12 jersey. No, they didn't. No, it was just an appreciation day. They they didn't retire his jersey. They didn't give, put him in the Hall of Fame because he hasn't been away too many years. Like, it was kind of a weird just like, hey, Tom Brady day. I don't know. We're gonna have time Brady here so people show up. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the Patriots Hall of Fame next year, yeah. Yeah, I was watching part of that game yesterday, actually. Yeah. yeah. I think it was just for fun. Right? This is basically to bring him out at halftime and have him run around the field and everybody cheered for him. Pretty much the clip that I saw anyway. I don't know. All right, Starms, I'm on the other end of that really long straight track, so you're good to roll on. Oh, well, I'm rolling, rolling at all 15 mile an hour. 
80% regulator. They almost came back yesterday? Okay. I missed the very end of that game. I was actually watching it, and I said, Dad, I want to watch the end of this game. And he goes, no, we're going home. It's going to be dark by the time the game ends. And I was like, true. This, okay. All right. All right, DGM. All right. All right. There was a... Uh, I'm not going to talk about it. There was a thing we wanted to see on the way home from the farm yesterday. That's why we wanted to leave before dark. Yeah. It's not like Dad's afraid of the dark. It's just there was something we wanted to see on the way home. It was, would have been difficult to see if it was dark out there. So, so yeah. All right, I'm uh, leaving the roundabout with the engine anyway. That's, yeah, that's the biggest problem trying to watch uh, Big Brother on Sunday night, Sean. Always, always an issue doing that, you know? Back when we used to, like, record it, we'd always record, like, extra. Uh, well, I think Big Brother time went, went over from the 10 o'clock stuff, well, too. Yeah, because the, the football game sets back 60 minutes. They're still going to air all of 60 minutes. They just shift the schedule, basically. This is the way that works. It's kind of annoying, but it is what it is. All right. We're here, chat. After a bit of a run. I think that's the farthest run that we have on the whole map. It is. Moving to 10, 10 30. Really? Interesting. But yeah, that's always been the issue with having but, like live sports but on. Is, or they're starting at seven o'clock now. I don't know. At least that's what they said on the series. Oh, they shifted the whole schedule then. Okay, wow. Well. <laughs> right, Jeff. Yeah, but 60 Minutes is their, like, Pride and Joy show that I allegedly, I guess, brings in a lot of viewers or something. I don't know. But it is pretty much the same news crap, yeah. I just don't watch news because it's all, it's all garbage, y'all. My opinion, of course, it's all garbage. But yeah. Yeah, I just watch the news for the weather report and traffic, basically. Yeah. Big Brothers or some money maker, yeah. But sixty minutes is like that's a that's a that's a history kind of show, you know. Like it's been around forever. Hey, and time to open her up. Full send, like the sign says. Sixty minutes. Uh, yeah, no, sixty minutes does actually. There are well, there can be some interesting things, yeah. Because there's no riders, Sean. That's why. I think. I think as far as that schedule, yeah, it's the same for Big Brother. I think. We're about to have this place like looking real shabby, y'all. I am parked over here, Storms. All right. Don't, don't run me over too much, okay? Alright. Yeah, where are you, Storms? Uh. Refinery. Yeah. Where are you at, Trent? I'm following the same line you guys already said. Oh, <laughs> you're just coming with us? <laughs> I didn't feel like stopping, so. <laughs> Trent's like, get out of my way. I'm not uh, driving. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny right there. Alright, unload, unload, let's go. That's amusing. You know, we almost, like, don't need any more coal down here for a while, huh? Interesting. Mm, 
got you, Sean. Okay. Gotcha first time. Yep, that's the problem with having any like scripted DV on after football, because you know football's always gonna run over. At least a few minutes here, a few minutes there, and it's it's very annoying. But it is what it is, you know. It is what it is. I have stopped right behind you. I need to step away for a few minutes. Alright, all good. We'll get you unloaded. Yep. Polar Bear, we'll catch you later. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, Trent, where are you at? Okay. If you want to run over here and help me unload these, it'd be a whole lot easier too. And then you get. Oh, there you are. I see your caboose back there. <laughs> Storms' this train is somewhere right in front of you, so uh, you just might want to stop. Ha, 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 ha. 